Hey guys, in this video, I wanted to talk to you about uh, modules and assignment types. So in what we're looking at here in this assignment is a uh, module. What we're looking at here in this class is a module. And inside this module, we've got uh, the, the five different ways that an assignment can be uh, set up for submission. And you will notice that in this module, uh, the first assignment here is in nice bold lettering and the others are grayed out. The reason for that is that teachers can set up these modules so that you have to go through them in order. And I should uh, start off with what a module is. A module is a way to group different assignments and uh, maybe even throw in discussions or pages or whatever. Uh, all together so that you as a student know that, hey, this is what I'm supposed to do all together for this week or this unit or whatever. Okay, so let's look at these different types of assignment. And how do you submit <clears throat> your uh, answers to this type of assignment? So the first one is a file upload assignment. So <clears throat> it's just, it's going to have instructions and things here. It's telling you what to do. But the idea here is that when you're going to, if, if you have to, say, write out a paper on, in Word or create a PowerPoint or something like that where you're going to have uh, a file that you need to turn into your teacher, when you go to the assignment here, the instructions will be here, but you get the Submit Assignment button up here at the top. So we'll hit Submit Assignment, and then that opens up this, this area down here at the bottom. And what we need to do is actually choose a file because we're going to look for a file that is in our uh, in our uh, computer or our Office 365 window. So I'll talk about that here in a second as well. But I'm going to hit choose a file. And what it does is it opens up my file browser so that I can um, go through and find my file wherever it happens to be. So I'm just going to grab this document 16, hit open, and see how it's posted right here, document 16.doc. And then all I have to do is hit assignment. Now, if I wanted to make a comment to the teacher, like, hey, sorry, uh, uh, enjoy my assignment, or, you know, sorry, this is late, or whatever, you could do that, and then hit sit, submit assignment. That's all you have to do. I'm going to, before I do that, I'm going to jump over here to Office 365 and show you what this looks like. Because we as a district use the, off, we use Office 365. Uh, this is our Microsoft tool, so we're going to log in. And then it pops out this login thing. Oh no, something went wrong with the authentication. So again, that kind of stuff happens. And that's why it's perfectly fine. Don't even bother with all that. Just use this choose file, The uh, grab the document that you want to submit. Oh, I unchose it. Document 16, open, and then submit assignment. Wait for it. And done. It's done. You know it's done because it says over here, submitted. It tells you what day and time it was submitted. Uh, you've got up here the big blue button. It doesn't say submit assignment anymore. It says resubmit assignment. So now if you made a change, there's something like, oops, I grabbed the wrong file. You hit this right here. You can hit this button to download exactly what it was that you uploaded. So if, if it gets deleted off your computer or whatever, that's fine. And then submission details. We click submission details. And then it gives you this here. And it's got the it's got the, the file again. It's got the uh, uh, note that I left. You can add another note. You can do a media comment. We'll talk about that in a minute. Or you can view feedback from the teacher. Okay, so let's go ahead and go back home. And see, we've submitted this one. It's got a green check mark, meaning that it's been done. And now the next assignment is opened up. This one is a type of assignment that's, uh, that's no, uh, no submission assignment. Meaning the teacher can set this up where they have it, it's called an assignment, there's points uh, on it, the teacher's going to give you a grade for it, or can give you a grade for it, they don't have to, but they can give you a grade for it, but there's nothing for you to submit. So this is something like, uh, go out and talk to whatever, interview somebody, but don't worry about turning anything in. Okay, that's, that's what this kind of assignment is. So if you get to the assignment and you don't see a button up here, for submission, and <clears throat> your teacher is expecting you to turn something in, you need to get in contact with your teacher and make sure that that teacher has the assignment set up correctly, and they, they might not have it set correctly. So in this case, it, this goes back to being a module too. This has nothing uh, for me to do other than just what, what it says in the instructions. So now I can hit next, 
And it's going to go directly to the very next thing in that module. So I'll do that. I'll hit next. And here's the text entry assignment. So in this type of assignment, you are going to submit a written answer that you're going to type out in the box. So I'm going to hit submit assignment. And then it opens up a rich text editor. So I can come down here. And my favorite color is blue. All right, so that's done. And so there you go. So that's your favorite color. And then actually it's got this, it's got a comments thing down here at the bottom. It's kind of like a CC. It, uh, it, it, it's uh, something extra that you can say like, this is my answer and this is my comment about the answer. You know, uh, like, uh, please go easy on me. I'm doing the best I can, that kind of stuff, right? So that's that. And you've got all of these magic tools up here that you can use. Now, let's say, look, maybe you're really bad at typing or you've got some kind of learning disability or something to that effect. You can actually go a step beyond here. And that is with this little button right here, which is record or upload media. So I can hit this button and then it opens up this. It, is, it wants to use my microphone and my camera. I'm going to tell it to allow it. And then, ta-da, it shows me, hello. So now I can start recording. Three, two, one. Hello, teacher. I am doing an assignment, and this is the correct answer. And then finish when I'm done. You can preview it. You can give it a name. I'm not caring about any of that, so I'm just going to hit save. <clears throat> and there it is. So you've got a couple options right there. And then I can hit submit assignment and it goes firing off. Okay, so it's the same thing like, it, like we did in that first assignment, where it's got the resubmit, it's got the submission details, and that it has been submitted and all that. So let's go to the next assignment. Type, website URL assignment. So this is basically where if the teacher's like, hey, go find me a resource that says that, uh, that this is the information that we need or whatever. Okay, so I'll just grab this now expired <laughs> uh, <clears throat> radar loop here. And that's it. Just grab, all I did was I highlighted the URL. I hit Control C to copy it. I went back to the submission, posted my, my uh, cursor here inside the website URL, Control V to paste, and now we're done. We don't have to with any of this stuff here because it's just the URL. So I'm gonna hit Submit Assignment, and ta-da, same old, same old. That's all you do, right? So let's go to the next thing. Media recording assignment. Okay, so again, your instructions will be here. The uh, submission type is tell, it's telling you right there. And then we're going to submit assignment right here. And down here is media. Use the link below to record your submission. So record or upload media. I hit the button and it pops out that same media recorder that I was showing you in that rich text editor. So it's the same process. So if your teacher says, I don't want video, I want audio, okay. Well, let's see, let's push some buttons and see what happens. Let's hit the mic, the mic is good. Let's hit the webcam, and oh, there we go. It, whoop, it's blocked by the screen because I'm in, I'm in student view. Oh, there it goes, no video. Okay, so I hit no video, and then all of a sudden, uh, magically, it's just my voice. So now I can record, three, two, one. This is a video, uh, this is not a video, this is just audio of me giving you the correct answers and then finish. Okay, so the other option here, uh, you can preview it and, and save it, is that you can upload media. So you hit upload media and then you can go through and select, let's select the audio file. It opens up and then you go find your audio file because this is your web browser, your, your file browser. And the same thing for video file, you go and find your video file, right? Either way, no big deal. But if you want to record it in-house on the computer, that's the way you do it right there. You hit save. And then it's not submitted yet, so ready to submit. Click Submit Assignment button to finish. You have to hit the button. And remember, there's an option there to, to make some comment. So that is, you see there's no next here. That's the end of the module. So I've submitted everything in the module. Everything is submitted. I'm going to go back to the home page to double check. Every single one of these things in the module has a green check. So that is it. That, those are the different types of assignments. Those are the ways that you can uh, make those submissions. And uh, uh, if you need any help at all, let your teacher know. And if your teacher needs uh, help as well, then uh, they'll let us know.